Alright, what is up everybody? It's Cookie here, and like I said, I'm going to be doing some Borderlands 2, and I'm definitely going to be doing pre-sequel after this, because pre-sequel Borderlands 2 are one of my favorite games. Borderlands 2 is one of my favorite game, personally. Pre-sequel, not quite there, but still a really good game, seeing as it's made by Gearbox. So, basically, I'm just going to be starting a new character and bringing you all the way through normal mode. And if you want to see more after that, then that's up to you guys in the comments. So let's get straight into it. Now I'm good. I, I, I'd rather not. Thanks. Well, oh, shit. Alright, so if you're wondering why I'd escape that, it's because, let's be honest, nobody really is gonna stick by and see that. So, uh, let's get into it. I'm gonna be doing just a basic, you know. Should be Assassin or Gunsurker, you know? You know? You know, you know. I'll do a Gunsurker, you know? It just feels good. That feels normal. Actually, no, 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 no. Now I'm gonna be I'm gonna be assassin and I'm gonna go straight for this. Where is it? There we go. And then let's just go for a cheeky name of. There we go. Cut trap. Let's go. By the way, before this whole thing gets in, sorry about the background noise. I have a baby brother in the background. No, we're not torturing little kids. So if you hear that, really sorry. It should be gone in the next video. And some Jack's been busy. Wait, you're not dead. Yes, now I can get off this glacier. Claptrap, your metaphorical ship has finally come in. Sorry, I'm gonna stop now. I've played this game so much that I've kind of known every, pretty much every dialogue ever by heart. But my friends call me Claptrap, or they would if anyone's still alive or exists in the first place. Here, I got something for you. Take the second container that I totally moved one of these at corpses. Because <laughs> of the class auto display. Complete with the minimap. Now, come, come, my friend. Let's get you inside. Alright, I'm done. 100% done. I guarantee, promise you, I'm not going to copy any dialogue ever. Don't worry about those 180 golden keys. I I just kind of went through orcs.com and spammed golden key codes. Totally didn't take three hours of my life out doing that. And then here's just some cheesy, stupid dialogue that you have to deal with when you make a new character. Yada, yada, yada. Don't really care. This stuff. Cool. And then we'll get the sniper and we'll put it right there. Let's go. So one thing you're going to find out when watching me play Borderlands 2 is that I kind of know nearly every single secret about it, and I'm gonna try to veer off from using glitches, just because I tend to use them a lot because I've played it vanilla a lot, and it's just, you know. But I really think I'm gonna have a lot of fun recording this and posting it on YouTube, and this is gonna be one of the series that I'm gonna be finishing and actually playing through because I do absolutely love this game, so there you go. And whenever I do walkthroughs and stuff like that, I'm gonna be not cutting out or doing anything like that. So this walkthrough is gonna be aimed towards people that haven't really played Borderlands 2. And if you have played Borderlands 2 and plan on watching this, then that means you're just a prude. You're a true. You're a prune. You're a prune. Yep. Sorry. I uh, have a speech impediment of just choking when you're on camera. Anyways. If you're watching this walkthrough and you have played Borderlands and have seen Borderlands before, then that just means you're a true fan, and I really appreciate it. So I'm going to start this video off with, if you like, end up liking the video, make sure to leave a like. I mean, that's what the like button's for. And if you really like the video and like my other videos, then subscribe, because then you'll get notified for whenever I post a new video. There we go. I'm actually quite depressed. I told you I wouldn't do it. I'm sorry. The dialogue in this game is just really funny, so, you know. Yeah, pretty safe. Yeah, definitely safe, Claptrap. Really safe. Clearly, because if, if it wasn't safe, then Knuckle Dragger wouldn't come in and take your eye out. Oh wait, Knuckle Dragger came in and took your eye out. Your place must not be safe. Alright. 
This episode is gonna go straight up until we get to get to Liarsburg. I think that'll be a good stopping point for the first one. Don't you think, April? April? April. <laughs> Apparently it's April. Angel. See, she clearly just said that we're gonna stop when we get to Liarsburg. Thanks. Thanks, Angel. Kill it. Kill it with Gearbox. Yeah, I feel so special. I felt so special when I first got these weapons. But then realize you get them every single time you start a character. So the reason we're going for the assassin is just because he's kind of the base character that everybody chooses when they first start a game. So I think it would be good. And he's just a kind of a cool character. So if this means anything to you, we're going to be going straight down the middle skill tree. Actually, no, I lied. We're going straight down the right skill tree. See, the one thing different about this Let's Play slash walkthrough and other people's walkthrough is that I know everything about this game, so I'm not getting anything out of this. This is just solely for your information slash your enjoyment. And obviously, like like it is for most walkthroughs slash Let's Plays, first few episodes aren't the best because you're just getting past all the tutorial shit, but, you know, once you get past all that and you're just kind of free roaming and doing whatever you want, it gets a little bit more interesting because you're not just sitting there being restrained to one thing and one thing only. One thing I recommend while watching this is that you actually pay attention to the dialogue because even if you don't like reading the subtitles and stuff, just try to listen because <laughs> the dialogue is actually really funny in this game and that really is what makes Borderlands Borderlands is all of the dialogue. No scope. No scope, everybody. Just no scope them. Ah, oh, shit. Get trick shot. Get headshot, nerd. Get smacked. So, I actually only have 1400 badass rank because I just bought this handsome collection for PlayStation. I think I had 70,000 or 90,000 or something like that on Xbox. So, yeah. Just, just kind of prove that to you that I played this just a little bit, you know. Get smacked. Get butterflied. Get 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 wombo comboed and Skype. Can can you not? I'd rather you not. Oh no, oh no, oh no. He just launched me back. Thanks, man. Kill yourself. <laughs> just love quick scoping in Borderlands. It's my favorite pastime. Clatrop, can you fall down faster, please? Thanks, man. Really appreciate it. Oh, I didn't hit it. Damn it. Come on, could you come up faster, mate? Oh my god, I am not doing that great. So it's gonna be super fast pace. And watch me actually get the Hornet or the Logan's gun from Knuckle Dragger. I'll kind of cry because I farmed this guy for so long on my other on my siren, waiting to get the Hornet or the Logan's gun. And Knuckle Dragger just kind of kept spamming you with Jacob's pistols. Which I don't even like. I'd rather a reactor than a Jacob's pistol. Vault Hunter gets killed by me. You see, you seen the problem here? You're still alive. So if you could just do me a favor and off yourself, that'd be great. Thanks, Pumpkin. I love you, Jack. Full homo. Even though I'm pretty sure you're like 20 years old and I'm fucking 14. Anyways. And an incredibly handsome robot. I'm stopping. I'm stopping now. I stop here. You guys are eligible to see me in public and kick me in the balls, alright? I'm sorry. Guarantee you, when you first read that, you thought it was Knuckle Rager, if you didn't pay attention to the dialogue. Because every time I play with like one of my cousins or something, they're just like, Oh my god, it's Knuckle Rager! Because that's exactly how they sound. Frickin' Knuckle Rager. I'm gonna kill you, Knuckle Rager. And you're already dead. Oh my god, I swear to god, if that was a freaking hornet. No, okay. I got a little bit scared. I was about to cry if it was a hornet. Switching weapons. Switch weapons using triangle. Oh, I bet I would never figure that out. That is, oh my god. Gearbox, thank you for telling me that tip. I am deeply in your f for forgiveness. I don't, I don't know. Much as I'm sure you like to jam your your little 
No, I'm just gonna stop. Cause I'm just gonna mess up. I'm just gonna choke, and it's just gonna be horrible. This video hasn't been going for that long. The other videos of this series will probably go for a little bit longer, but it's good. Liars, bugs on the other side of this Hapidian barge. Hey, kid. Hey, kid. Can, can you calm down? Boop. 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 Mess you up, Claptrap. Mess you up, Claptrap. Another thing is, I guarantee, or I don't guarantee, but pretty much every time I see someone start off a new game and they've never played Borderlands before, they jump in front of this thing. And I don't know why they jump in front of this one, but they decide to jump in front of this one. And then it says intruders detecting, they're just like, oh my god, did I do that? And I can't lie, I did that my first time too. Not gonna lie. You're just a psychopath, and you're just like, let me just mess up Claptrap. Let me just ruin his day. And then you just turn around and fing... Never mind. <clears throat> <clears throat> Anyways. Alright. So. We got a horrible shotgun. And then we turn into best... Nope. Blindsided. Lol. So right on the other side of this is Liarsburg. But I'm not going to go there until the next episode. Because, I don't know, I'm just going to leave you off here. So if you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more Borderlands, leave a like and subscribe. See you in the next episode. Peace.